Hey guys, um, so today we're over at the Strid. Uh, this is at Bolton Abbey, just outside of Skipton. And it's considered to be one of the most dangerous, well, if not the most dangerous river in the world. And um, now it doesn't look very strong, does it? I mean, you can see there's a, quite a whirlpool going on there. But what makes it so destructive is that this river here is the River Wharf. Um, and that will show you a picture of how wide that is, or a few hundred meters up river. I and mean, it's about 213 feet deep, which I think is 65 meters. Um, or about 15 double-decker buses stacked on top of each other. The massive river wharf all sneaking through that tiny gap. Amazing. And what happens is it just creates these, a whirlpool underneath that just sucks you under. The currents are so strong that apparently if you get inside, there's a 100% fatality rate. There's a rope here to try and save you. So I don't know if you, if you had a rope, would you be able to get out? I don't know, let us know in the comments. When we came a few months ago, I came with the kids and we did a big video at Bolton Abbey showing the entire estate, just in case you're thinking of coming to visit this river. Um, but yeah, we didn't have any idea just how dangerous it was then. And if you look around, there's not a lot of signage, you know, to say how bad it is, how dangerous it is. Just that little bit where the rope is, um, and there's a, a danger sign there saying it has claimed lives. But the other reason it's so dangerous, if you look at the rocks, uh, they are covered in moss, aren't they? Uh, wet slippery moss so even if you if, when you get inside look if you look down there it's really difficult to climb out um, especially with those currents um, and also if you look down here you'll see that it does get quite narrow at points and that's where really everyone seems to fall into trouble this must be one of the areas where people think they can jump it because you can see the ledge comes out there and um, it looks like it might be jumpable and it looks so unassuming doesn't it the river down there uh, so calm but those undercurrents are still there they'll still get you and it can be very very dangerous which is why i'm guessing uh, the rope we mentioned is just over there in the distance and um, close to this part here so my question to you then is what do you think is the strid is it the most dangerous river in the world? 100% fatality rate, apparently. Or do you know of any tales of people being uh, pulled out alive? You know, do, is it 100% fatality rate or do you know different? Let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear it. Be sure to subscribe um, and hit the notification bell. Um, and for, for now, from Exploring the North, bye for now.